What's the difference between cats and dogs when it comes to food? People who own pets have been arguing for years about whether cats and dogs can eat the same food. Even though it might be easier to feed your cat and dog the same food, their nutritional needs are very different. Figuring out why this difference exists is very important for making sure our pets are healthy and happy. 1. Differences in diet. Because of their natural instincts and the way their bodies are made, cats and dogs have grown with different dietary needs. Because dogs are omnivores, they can eat both animal and plant-based things and still be healthy. Cats, on the other hand, must eat meat because they need protein, taurine, and arachidonic acid, which are all found in meat. 2. Needs for protein. Protein is an important part of both cats' and dogs' diets, but they need different types and amounts. Cats need more animal-based proteins, especially meat, in their food to meet their needs. Cats, unlike dogs, don't have certain enzymes that are needed to break down plant proteins properly. Because of this, they need to eat mostly meat for good health. The next two are taurine and arachidonic acid. Arachidonic acid and taurine are amino acids that are very important for cats' health. Taurine is important for eyesight, heart health, and reproductive health. Arachidonic acid is important for keeping a cat's skin and hair healthy and for growth in general. Dogs can make these amino acids on their own, but cats need to get them from their food, which shows how important it is for cats to eat meat. The metabolism of vitamin A. Cats' vitamin A absorption is different from ours. Dogs can turn beta-carotene from plants into vitamin A, but cats need vitamin A that is already made in animal cells. Cats can get serious health problems like eye issues and immune system problems if they eat food that is low in this important vitamin. Five. Changes in fatty acids. The fatty acids' needs of dogs and cats are also different. Omega-3 and omega-6 fatty acids are important for both species, but the best amounts and sources can be different. Long-chain fatty acids, like arachidonic acid, are found in large amounts in animal cells and are especially important for cats. 6. Balance of calcium and phosphorus. Keeping the right amount of calcium and phosphorus in the body is important for both cats and dogs' bones. The best amount for each species is different, though. Cats need a higher calcium amount and a more specific calcium to phosphorus ratio than dogs do. This makes it even more important to make cat food that is specifically made for cats. In conclusion, cats and dogs have different food needs because of how they evolved and how their bodies are different. Dogs can handle a wider range of foods, but cats must eat meat and have special nutritional needs that must be met to stay healthy. Giving each species the right food for their specific needs is an important part of being a caring pet owner and helps our furry friends live longer and be healthier. If cats and dogs can eat when they're really hungry, cats and dogs can both eat when they are really hungry. Cats and dogs, among other animals, are naturally hungry and will look for and eat food to meet their nutritional needs. Pet owners should make sure their animals get the right food on a daily basis to keep them healthy. But it's very important to make sure you feed them a meal that is balanced and full of all the nutrients they need. As we talked about in the last section, cats and dogs have different nutritional needs. So it's important to feed them food that is made for their species. Also, quick changes in diet or eating too much can cause digestive problems, so it's best to introduce new foods slowly. Make sure your dogs always have access to clean water and keep an eye on them for any signs of health problems or allergies that could be caused by what they eat. If you are worried about your pet's diet or appetite, you should talk to a vet. They can give you information that is specific to your pet's health, age, and way of life. We hope you found the video useful. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to support us. Hope to meet again with new content.